सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट स्मूथ मेल्टिंग लिक्विड चॉकलेट एनिमेशन विद यूजिंग फ्लिप फ्लूइड ऐड ऑन सी गाइस दैट्स माय रियली स्मूथ चॉकलेट इफेक्ट लाइक अ क्रीम राइट ओके सो गाइस नाउ आई विल शो यू हाउ टू क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ एनिमेशन गाइस दिस ट्यूटोरियल वेरी इजी सो फर्स्टली गाइस सेलेक्ट ऑल एंड प्रेस डिलीट एंड नाउ Guys, I have Oreo 3D model biscuit. So go to an append. See, guys, that's my Oreo biscuit. Guys, I already download this object from Sketchfab. So go to an object, select and append. Check. Yeah. See, it's my 3D biscuits. So guys, click on here. Texture preview. Yeah, perfect. And next one, guys, rotate your 3D model. So select and rotate like this, like 180. So guys, Z axis are like zero, and now guys, little bit increase scale size. So press S letter and scale size increase and more. Little bit, yeah. This size is perfect. Okay, so guys, now press one and attach on this flow. Yes, perfect. So guys, now I apply collision effect on this basket. So go to on here, and guys, I apply flip fluid add-on. Select and this my type. So I apply obstacle check. Yes, that's it. And again, Shift D for duplicate. Yeah. So go to an up like this. Guys, attach on corner and little bit up. Yes, that's it. Yes, perfect. Okay. So guys, now next one. Uh, I apply more. So again, Shift D. Go to an up. Yes, and one more time. Guys, lastly, Shift D. Yes. And now, guys, I change this time only position. Select this one, and position little bit change like this. Yeah, perfect. And guys, select this three biscuit and duplicate. So go to on here. So little bit change position. Yes, great. Right, guys, I create randomly. And press seven for top view panel. Okay, so guys, don't overlap. Yeah, perfect. And lastly, guys, I apply one more. So again, Shift D, Enter, go to on here, and press one and rotate your biscuit. Rotate like this, and guys, go to on up. Yes, and guys, apply to on this side. Yes, great. See, so guys, that's my simple composition. And now, guys, this time I take plane for background. So go to an add and mesh and take plane and increase scale size. So scale size increase. And guys, I create backdrop. So go to an here and press E and G and go to an up extrude. So select this one edge and I apply bevel. Bevel check, guys. Amount zero point one five and segments thirty. Yeah, perfect. And now, guys, right click shade smoother. Guys, I apply this time a uh, black color. So create new material. So color I like black, like this, and roughness zero point two five. Yeah, perfect. And now, guys, press one. So guys, little bit up, little bit. Yes, good. Okay, so next one, guys, I apply cube for domain. And press one and increase cube size. So click on here wireframe. So I select this one and I take like a six six and height six and go to an up. Yeah, perfect. And now, guys, this time I take spare and change spare radius. So radius zero point one five and go to an up. Yes, this position is good. Like a six centimeter x six six. Meter and now guys, I create animation. So guys, frame, uh, frame I like a three fifty, and position I will change like this. Okay, so guys, go to on here, and like a minus three point five, and check. Now guys, go to like a hundred frames, hundred, and position actually location change like a four. Yes, and actually take a three point five. It's good. And check. Yes, that's it. So now, guys, duplicate. So press Control C. Go to frame like a two hundred frames. 
and paste yes and guys one more time go to like a 400 and frame i increase like a 500 and paste yeah that's it so guys again go to back and play yeah this is my simple position animation right and now guys this time i apply liquid effect so stop and go to on I select this sphere, flip add on, and this is my inflow. Yeah, and select this one. This is my cube and domain, domain check. Yes, and guys, save your project. So go to on desktop and create new folder. New folder check, take any file name, accept. Yes, so now, guys, I create thick liquid. So, guys, I take viscosity and viscosity this one, viscosity check. And viscosity, I like a uh, 2.5. 2.5 is good. And surface tension check. And now let's go to an advance. And this is my max. Max, I like 18. Yeah, that's it, guys. So guys, this is my simple setting. And use APIC. APIC check. Yeah. And guys, I change resolution. Guys, best resolution is 400. Like a 420. But in my case, I show you only tutorial. So resolution 256. But you should take a 400 or yeah, 500. And guys, bake or check guys. Uh, also guys, I change uh, keyframe. That's my FPS. I like 30 FPS. And go to one again. Bake or dynamic check. Guys, take a lots of time like a uh, one hour and two hours. Depend your system configuration. So guys, my baking is still progress and it's take a 85 frames. So guys, now I show you my liquid simulation. So guys, closer and play. Yeah, see guys, it's my beautiful and smooth melting animation. Melting, right? Okay, so guys, now I apply this time material. And guys, my simulation is really smooth. So guys, go to on here, select this one and factor i like two and repeated i like 10 yes perfect actually factor one okay so now guys this time i apply material so use blender kit add-on and type milk guys i apply white material select and simple click yeah and we go to on here yes perfect see guys that's my texture and composition so next one guys i apply camera and Guys, go to on here, add and camera check. Set your camera angle. Select your camera, go to down. Yeah, this angle is perfect. Yes, great. Okay, so also guys, I apply area light. Go to on here and use light area light. And top, increase this time uh, power 100. And size, I like 5. Yes, perfect. And now go to on camera. So guys, I change render setting, cycle render, device GPU check. Guys, SAMP 256 is perfect. 256. Yeah, that's it guys. And now go to on render and render image check. Okay. So guys, HDRI lighting is missing. So go to on here, close. And this time guys, I apply HDRI and environment texture. So guys, you can apply any environment texture like this and open. So guys, strength I change like a 1.4 and one more time render, render image check. Yeah, see guys, that's my render. So guys, my render looking perfect, right? And simulation, it's really good. Smooth simulation. Okay, so guys, now close and go to on here. So guys, click on here and one more time. Guys, see that's my resolution. So again, play. Yes, it's my smooth melting animation. So stop, stop, go to back and pause. Guys, I increase this time resolution. Guys, 420 resolution is perfect. And go to on here, like 420. And again, reset all and bake check. Yes, that's it, guys. Okay, so guys, that's it. My work is finished. So guys, if you like my video, please share and please subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.